Well, can you believe it? That's the view from my dressing room. <laughs> uh, that has to be the best view I think I've ever had of a dressing room uh, by quite some way. So what I'll do is I'll take you onto the stage now at Sydney Opera House and go and show you around a little bit. It's alright because we just follow the arrows, <laughs> otherwise we get horrendously lost in this place. Just finished a rehearsal with the orchestra, sounded great. Very looking forward to doing tonight's show. A bit tired, but I know I'll have some energy as soon as I get out there. So let's not worry about that. So, here we go. Through the famous doors of the Sydney Opera House, where the piano is being tuned. And here we are. All in dark. Can't really see much. Let's climb down some, uh, some ladders. This is where I break my neck. Conductor overboard and all that. Quite a spectacular place this, it's got over a million tiles on its roof and uh, it was nearly not completed because it's something like a hundred times over its original budget. Let's go and sit where the nice men who control the sound and the light sit. Dave, this is his desk and that's the sound desk run by a guy called Oysters and that if you can see anything, is the Sydney Opera House. Well, it's a first for me, and I feel very privileged to be here. Not only conducting, but to be here with such a great artist. And uh, I'm very proud. So, from a happy brummy boy in Sydney, I'm going to go and do a great gig. Ciao for now.